Relationship marketing is the path to success for online marketing. When you build a relationship with your prospects, clients, and customers, you'll develop a solid business, whether it's an online business or a brick-and-mortar business entirely offline. Today, however, in this article, I want to focus on the online marketer and the strategies that will prove successful for you. There are several steps to relationship marketing, have something to give away for free to give people a chance to know you stay in contact with people frequently and regularly be prepared to give excellent and immediate customer service educate people as to what you have to offer and why they should listen to you continue to think of reasons they should open your emails, read them, and take action make sure you are offering high value. Top shelf products let's look more closely at two of these. Points, staying in contact frequently and regularly out of sight, out of mind. Have you ever heard that? It's true in marketing as well. The easiest way to stay in touch with people online is with email. You can use broadcast emails such as with Constant Contact, MailChimp, RatePoint or other such services, or it can be emails set up through your autoresponder service. There is an art and a science to sending emails that educate, keep people's interest, and keep them coming back for more. That whole subject can't be covered in this article, but I urge you to get educated about it. Offer excellent and immediate customer service. Have you ever had an experience when you clicked on a link, found something you were interested in, and yet you wanted a little more information, or you wanted a specific question answered? You looked, and looked, but found no contact info or no way to ask a simple question. When I have found this to be the case, I just move on. I figure if it's this hard before purchasing, it would be a nightmare after the face. The least you should do is offer a customer support email address. But, if you don't answer each email promptly and politely, you'll lose the sale just as quickly as if you had no support email. Sometimes, I've just hit reply to an email from an autoresponder, especially when they're written so well it appears to be talking to me personally. If someone does that to one of your autoresponder emails, just go ahead and answer it, even though it didn't come through the normal channels for communication. If you will reply to people in a personal way, you'll gain a long-term customer. It will also make you stand out in the crowd. Marketers these days are not that interested in individual customers. But, isn't that who's buying? Think about it. No groupthink here, think individuals. It will pay off in the long run and you'll be an expert relationship marketer. I invite you to visit Make Email Work and pick up some information about email marketing which could be very helpful to you.